Hi, I'm Mark, and this is Diary of Awakening, my journey to find authenticity and a life extraordinary. I'm having a spiritual awakening. I didn't realize when I started 12 years ago that that was what it was, but it's becoming readily apparent that the more I can transmute those lower energies I have, the fear, the shame, the blame, the anger, into actually look through them or work out what it is that is my fear. I get to see what is my spiritual goal, and then I get to, then I get options, which gives me more opportunity. It's healing that stuff, those wounds that I had as a kid, um, and all the emotional hurt uh, by coming to terms with that, working through it, processing it, and then working out what is my true self. Put the fear aside, even if I still feel it, then I can think to myself, okay, great, I still feel this fear, it's over there, but what do I want? What do I really, um, what do I want for my life? And my life in the last year has been a crazy ride. And, but it's this, I think this journey, this kind of life journey doesn't have to be a physical journey. Okay, I've been on, I was in South America and now I'm in California and it looks like I'm gonna be going to India but this is available to everyone. Um, I never thought it was available to me. I never even wanted to go on it, and now I'm really enjoying it. And it's from other working with other people, and they've asked me what, they've asked me good questions. And if I can be honest about, if I can be honest in those responses, then I get to make decisions based on what is my truth, and actually, my life goes a lot better. It's the more insight I can get into my emotions, my working, my my inner, my um, that gives me more spiritual connection, and the journey becomes just incredible. Oh, and right now it's amazing. I'm focusing on intuition, that inner knowing of what I truly want for my life. And what gets in the way of that are those lower vibration emotions. And when they come up, I ask myself, what's this really about? What's the fear? What's the fear of visibility, fear of uh, I'm not good enough, or all that kind of stuff that comes up so regularly. And I can ask myself, is it real? Okay, no, it goes back to then when I was six years old, sitting in a classroom and someone said this to me. Okay, well, it's not real. So don't base a decision now on what happened 30 years ago. So it's um, having fun. It's an exciting journey. I think it's available to anyone. When I go up here in the morning, sometimes I don't feel so kind of chipper. And so actually I put on music. I, I've made some playlists, some inspirational playlists, some uh, motivation. It's in 432 hertz, so it resonates better with my body. And it's um, they're in the playlists on my channel. And that gets me going listen to him first thing, listen to him in the shower, after some meditation, and it's, then I feel my vibration change. And I see the possibility instead of just the fear. And for me, that makes all the difference. I call that emotional alchemy. It's taking those lower vibration, dark emotions, working through them, washing away what's not real, and finding that spiritual goal, that what is my true essence, what's my higher, self and how do I connect with that? That is proving to make my life extraordinary. And that's just, it's not me, I'm not some special case. Anyone can do this. If you think this video would help other people, please share it. If you've liked it, please like it. And um, if you want more updates or when you, the new playlists come out, subscribe and you'll get updated. I am finding the wonder in my life and I wish for you the same. Thanks for watching.